Virginia could be changing how much your paycheck goes to the government. Capitol Bureau reporter Jackie DeFusco is live in studio with more on what options lawmakers are looking at. Jackie. Hey guys, well, a new study lays out several paths for improving the fairness of Virginia's income tax system. But right now, lawmakers are split on the path forward. Virginia has not updated its tax brackets in more than three decades, deciding how much each person pays based on their income. It means a larger portion of the population is paying the state's highest tax rate. Senator Jeremy McPike says it's hitting low and middle income families the hardest. With income increasing over those 30 years, essentially if you make 50000 or $50 million, you pay the exact same tax rate right now. It's long overdue to be adjusted. A new nonpartisan report says adjusting tax brackets for inflation would mean everyone pays a little bit less, but the state would lose about a billion dollars each year. That goes towards key government services like schools. To balance that out, the study says lawmakers could raise taxes, but only on the highest income Virginians. That's something we've got to look at on the numbers. Again, I think the goal that we can shoot for is making sure we're at least revenue neutral and making the changes while also helping uh, middle to lower income uh, Virginians. But higher taxes for the highest income earners may be a tough sell for Republicans. Senator David Suderline says Virginians are already overpaying. Creating a new uh, tax burden there uh, where so much of the economic growth happens is a big mistake. Instead, he's pushing for more tax relief across the board by further increasing the standard deduction. The vast majority of Virginia taxpayers use the standard deduction, especially uh, lower and middle income uh, taxpayers, and I think that's what we ought to do. Now, in a letter, Virginia's Secretary of Finance serving under Governor Glenn Youngkin points out that changes approved earlier this year will lower tax liabilities. He says when lawmakers look at additional reforms in 2023, they should really consider the impact on Virginia's competitiveness compared to neighboring states with lower tax rates. I'm Jackie DeFusco, 8 News.